So what's the easiest thing about real estate? We're gonna talk about that coming up. Hey, thanks for sticking around today. Hey, if you're a new real estate agent or if you're just thinking about getting into real estate, hit that subscribe button below because I talk about real estate every week. Now today we're talking about the different parts of real estate and, and what's actually the easiest part <laughs> about real estate. If you're just now studying or if you're actually already a new agent, you understand that there's a lot of parts in this real estate business. And so, you know, in the beginning, you've got to study for those exams, the state and the national exams here in the state of Texas. And then you have to, <laughs> once you pass those tests, you have to go find a broker and hopefully you find a good broker that's going to help you with training. So you got to do some training. You know, real estate is one of those careers where you don't have like a like an internship. There's a lot of these big careers like you get to go practice before you actually get that license or get that degree in something. But real estate, you can't start practicing real estate until you have that license. So anyway, find you a good broker that's going to do a lot of training for you. So once you have that training, then you then you've got to start marketing yourself because you got to go out there and you got to find buyers and you've got to find sellers out there. So once you do find those buyers and sellers and someone wants to look at a home, then you've got to go show homes. And then once you show those homes and, and someone likes it, then you got to you gotta write a contract on it. So then you gotta negotiate that contract. Then you gotta deal with inspection, appraiser, lender, title companies. So there's a lot of moving parts and you as a real estate agent have to hold all those pieces together. You have to make sure everybody goes to that finish line. So yes, this business can be stressful, but we're here to talk about the easy part. So what is the easiest part about all that that I just mentioned? And mind you, there's a lot more to this than just those right there. So if you're already an agent, you kind of, you probably already know this answer. Yeah, it's passing those exams. That's the easy part. Now, if you're studying for those exams, I understand it's stressful uh, because you're getting stuff thrown at you. You have no clue what it's all about. Now, I've mentioned before in a previous video that on my uh, test, when I was practicing my test or studying for my exams, I did the online courses and I got all the books and everything like that. Uh, and where I made a mistake of studying was I was trying to read the whole book like every book that I had, I was trying to read it and study it because I really wanted to understand this business and understand everything about real estate. I would suggest going to one of those classes. Uh, I'll put a link to below to, to a, a course, to a company that you can actually go attend classes. And those online practice exams, those, man, those, those were a lifesaver for me. Anyways, I hit those like every night until I was making 80 to 100 on every test and I felt confident. Then I scheduled my final exams and here we are now. So go ahead, start planning ahead because that exam, that's the easy part. Plan ahead, figure out how you're gonna get that business once you do get licensed. Anyway, hope this helps out. Message me below if you have any questions. Thanks for hanging out. I'll see you next time.